Hello, Sydney. Would you like to play a game? What's your favorite movie? Check it out. Hello, everyone. Welcome back once again to the Carnival Toy Review. I am, like always, your immortal toy master. Willow. And today, on Villainous Thursday, finally I got a wicked evil person for Villainous Thursday. I have a bunch of villains, but they're like old villains, and I don't know if you guys really want to see super old villains. Um, my other old videos with older toys from Power Rangers, uh, the only old toy, vintage toy, um, I did was Captain America, or not Captain America, Captain Planet, and it did pretty good, but nobody really looks at the older Power Ranger villains but I do have an abundance of Power Ranger villains. If anyone wants to see them, let me know. But on this Villainous Thursday, I will be bringing to you the brand new NECA Ultimate Ghostface action figure. This thing is so dope. This material feels just like the material that you would get with this costume and with the mask when you would buy it from a store just shrunken down. He's got some, um, not cloth pants, but they look pretty good. They got, like, some blue jean look. You got some de very, very good detail in it. You got some brown boots with some laces up on them. He comes with the, so the knife with some blood on it. Look at that thing. It's got some blood on it. Ah. Hello, Sydney. What's your favorite movie? I want to call you on my cell phone. Oh my God, bitch. Why you gonna do this to me? I'm just joking. Um, probably get in trouble for that last one. <laughs> but anywho, here he is. He doesn't really stand on these naked stands, though. I wish he did. Um, but I have him on there. And he doesn't want to really stay. But this you can pull down. And it comes with three interchangeable hand heads so you get four heads with this figure this does pop off and it does it is kind of cool because you could take this head and put it on any like wwe figure with a poppable head or anything that pops their head off it's pretty cool because then you're going to put it on that but uh this pulls down um he has his voice changer he's got the regular white ghost face get him turned back over here um Give him the spin around. I gave him the one knife with the blood on it. Gave him the voice changer. And we'll do a little spinny spin spin skarooski so you can see the whole thing. He's got the arm danglies from the suit. Um, you can't pull his... You can if you really try. But I haven't. But this is like really thick right here. He's got a really thick forearm to make it look padded or something, I guess. But it is really cool. Um... So do the little spin skis, still spinning, spinning. Um, which way? I didn't know. Remember? And here's the back. Looks just like one of the suits. You could just pull over, and then you have the thing. You got the cut at the bottom. It's really simple and really cool at the same time. And that's a little bit it for the figure. For articulations, the arms do get the full 360 head pivot. Um pretty sure it's single elbow joints you have their uh the naked leg knee uh pivot thing he does have foot rocker and pivot um and this is the underneath part um it's just a basic sculpt you got the ball joint and then you got the the legs on ball joints and a mm, some kind of weird joint in there but it's still cool um so that's the underneath of it oh i drop up um that's not cool i know his hands do come out so you can interchange his hands so let me plug this hand back in there and there you go. 
And there he is. And now let's get into the accessories. I'm just going to leave the accessories in the box and I'll just pull the box up. So you guys can see what the accessories are. Um, it does... I wish he stood on there a little bit better. And here's the box. You get Ghostface on the front. Ultimate Ghostface action figure. And then on the side, you got him with Ghostface Nako. Real toys. On the back, you got another obligatory shot. You have the three faces, and you'll be able to see them more on the inside. He comes with a Sith, a glow-in-the-dark face, a rugged-looking mask, a bloody mask, a bloody knife. Ghostface, the icon of Halloween, which I don't understand why they would put the icon of Halloween. Um, returns with this brand new Ultimate Edition action figure. Featuring over... Sorry, I can't read really small stuff. Featuring over 25 points of articulation and real fabric cloth. And then you got him over here again. And then on the bottom you have all that stuff. And then a sad baby. Because he's three under three and he can't play. And on the top you have ages 17 and up. And the wife doesn't understand why it says it. And now, as you open the inside, you get Ghostface over here just standing in front of a, a thing. And here is all of his accessories. Let's pull this up. Get a little bit of that glare off of there. You get the naked the ghost face that glows in the dark. You have a bloody ghost face. You have this really cool looking ruggedy one. You have this really big scythe. And then at the bottom you get his two interchangeable hands. And then you get two more knives. And that's pretty much all you get with that's all you get with it. So that's about it for the review. Um, Nega is really stepping up their game with these figures. Um, I can't wait for the Nega Goliath from Gargoyles. That thing looks like it's gonna be like this big. It's gonna be beautiful. I can guarantee it. It's gonna be a piece of artwork. But. That is it. That's it for my villainous Thursday toy review. Sorry, I've been a little back ski, out ski, not been around ski for a week ski, but you know, ski. No, I'm just joking. Um, but if you like this video, like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below, and I will see you Sunday on Super Sunday. We have a bunch of wrestlers. I need to get reviewed. I got a bunch of wrestlers. I need to get reviewed. From someone from series 60 something all the way to the whole line of series 81 to get done. And then I got some Lucy Gooseys. Oh, whoa. Look at it. That's a good picture right there. Bam. Anywho. And then I got all this stuff over here some SPD, a Mighty Morphin to get done. So if you like that video, like, subscribe, leave me a comment down below. And... Hmm. Shin!